Open up! Hey! Do you hear me? <sighs> Funny that we'd end up here of all places. This is the room, right? Where Waku-san was staying? The man who died after you used him as a test subject for 89. Why'd you do it, Shono? For the glory? Thought nobody'd notice one missing dementia patient? What are you talking about? Get out of here! This is trespassing! Huh. <laughs> you sure you want us to go? Uh, huh? I thought you'd be a little more curious about how much of your secret I really know. I, I don't know what you're talking about. You're the one backing the mole. Isn't that right? Huh? How dare you accuse me of... That's not all I know. Hamura's the middleman. You pretty satisfied with his work? I won't stand for this baseless slander. What proof do you have? <laughs> You just made a big mistake, Shono-san. Huh? You've been working non-stop on this new drug, right? No way the street slang about a murderer would have reached your ears. You were supposed to ask what the mole is. Uh, what is the mole? There's a good boy. The serial killer who's been gouging people's eyes out. It all started three years ago. Right here in the center. <sighs> you performed an 89 experiment on Wakusan while he was asleep. Probably late at night. And when he died, you did the only thing you could. Snuck him out. <sighs> I'm sure Wakusan's death came as a complete shock to you. But you didn't have time to panic. You needed to hide the body, fast. So, you used the laundry cart to transport it without raising suspicion. You just needed to get it as far away as possible. Then, just before 8 a.m., Shinpei Okubo arrived at the hospital to gather the linens. That was your chance. You waited for an opening, hid the body in his truck. That wouldn't solve anything, though. Okubo would find Wakusan, and of course call the cops. Naturally, they'd then search for whoever stashed the body there. But you didn't have any other choice, did you? You had to take the risk, and somehow, it paid off. Turned out, Shinpei Okubo had a criminal record and was worried the police would suspect he murdered Wakusan. So, he didn't report it. Instead, choosing to bury the body deep in the Okutama Mountains. You were probably thrilled with Okubo. I mean, it's practically a miracle someone else stepped up and took the blame for you, wouldn't you say? I don't know what you're talking about. But then another miracle happened. One not so convenient for you. Okubo walked. And if he was innocent, that would mean someone else killed Wakusan. They might have even come after you if you didn't do anything. Which is when you sold your soul to the devil. What do you mean by that? Don't play dumb with me. You know all too damn well what I'm talking about. You needed to frame Okubo. And you murdered someone in cold blood to do it. Murder? Who are you accusing me of killing? Emi Terasawa, a co-worker of yours, and Okubo's girlfriend. Oh. 
you forced your way into their apartment and murdered Emmy. According to the autopsy report, she was stabbed at least 15 times. I didn't. Did she tell you Okubo-kun had been taking pills to help him sleep at night? Conveniently enough, he didn't wake up while you were murdering his girlfriend. Him smelling like booze was probably your doing too. Let me guess, you injected him with alcohol? That'd raise his BAC no problem. And sure, he could have died if you messed up, but that wouldn't have mattered. As long as you could chalk up Emmy's murder to a drunk, suicidal Okobo-kun. <sighs> and once you made sure you could pin the blame on Okobo, you set fire to the whole apartment. What evidence do you have to- Don't worry. I can't prove it yet. But I'm damn near positive I'm on the right track. I can see it in your eyes. Look. I know what you're thinking. 89 will save countless people. Meaning there's no way you're not doing the right thing. Well, I'm sorry to break it to you, Shono. But that's just not true. You know, when someone thinks they're in the right, that's when the real cruelty in people starts to come out. So what do you say, Shono? Are you really right? <laughs> Just what is going on in here, damn it? Oh, hey. We were just heading out. Why, you. And by the way, so sorry to hear about 89. <sighs> Maybe you, uh, need a few more humans to test it on? <gasps> <laughs> Don't worry. Shono san here didn't tell us a damn thing. But hey, I'm gonna find out the truth. Uh, uh, Even if it's the last thing I do.